Komm. Hallo. Oh, please. Hey, uh, I came to see if you were all right. Do you know, I, I don't think I've ever seen inside this room. <laughs> we can be a rough bunch in this family. And I'm sure on occasion, to a sensitive creature like you, you must feel like, well, let me ask, what does it feel like? The cold, frozen tundra. Right. Like that, then. An icy, dark, loveless cave. With no light, no hope, anywhere. Not even the faintest crack. I see. He will come around. He will eventually, when he realizes that you can never have the other one. Would it help you to realize we all think he's quite mad? That might have reassured me once, but I worry we're past that point now, sir. And if he, if this family can't give me the love and security that I feel I deserve, then I believe I have no option but to break away, officially, and find it myself. I wouldn't do that if I were Why not? Let's just say I can't see it ending well for you. I hope that isn't a threat, sir. No, not now. Out! Although we are both outsiders who married in, you and I are quite different. Yes. I can see that now. You're right to call me an outsider. I was an outsider the day that I met the... the 13-year-old princess who would one day become my wife. After all these years, I still am. We all are. Everyone in this system is a lost, lonely, irrelevant outsider. Apart from the one person, the only person that matters. She's the oxygen we all breathe, the essence of all our duty. Your problem, if I may say, is you seem to be confused about who that person is. Come. Um, just to say, your royal highness is the photographer. Thank you. 